Yo, it was goody. Chapter 12, the lucky me Sierra story. So boom, right? So boom. So they formed Voltron. That nigga went and got his boys. He had 20 people. Sierra's family had 20 people. They formed together. They outside my crib, right? So they my, they outside my crib, fucking my crib, but mustard, everything. They just fucking up the crib. They just fucking up the crib. They're like, you're lucky, come on, lucky, come on, lucky, come on. I don't come on. So, right? So they get when that I'm over at Prince's house. So I'm over there. And um, so the police come, they get up out of there. And so I make my way back to the block, right? Because I wanted to see the damage that was done. So I go across the street. I was looking out the window. Boom. Just trying to just trying to be smart. I ain't with the police contact. Plus, it was mad at them niggas. I was not fighting two families. I mean, I can wash niggas, but I can't wash up everybody. And I wanted to keep my streak of being undefeated in these streets and not try to be because a hero ain't nothing but a sandwich. So anyway, so um, I send uh, Naija over there, Kyrie and Brandon to go through the crib, check the stuff or whatever. Boom. Right. So they go in. They find out. Boom. The, the crib was a mess. They fucked up the whole crib. They broke stuff. Just they fucked up the whole crib. So we get some of the stuff, whatever, back, whatever, over. So me and Sierra go in there. And for the night, we slept over at, you know, uh, Niaja crib. So the next day, um, while all this stuff is going on. Now, nah, listen, now, nah, hold up. So speaking, speak that night, right? So I was reading on the police blotter that for some reason, that um, a car, right, that was outside of Prince's house got messed up pretty bad, pretty bad. I heard, I heard, I heard they broke all the windows. I heard that the tires were popped out. I heard, that's what I heard that happened. I also heard that, you know, someone had um, popped all the tires on their other car as well. I heard. And so, you know, I heard it happened because... You know what I'm saying? They had stole Sierra AC out her window, out our window, and put it in their window. And so, long story short, um, the next day, me and Sierra, she looked so sad and defeated. I felt so bad for her. I said, yo, if you want to leave now, you can leave. I get it. It's, this shouldn't be for this relationship. And so, um, she's like, no, I love you. And I'm riding this out with you. And my brother's foul. And she rode with me. And... Um, she went to the bank, right? They took all my money and stuff, right? So she went to the bank and gave me $200, right? I flipped it in two days, made it $1,200, gave her her money back. And she was like, you a bad boy. Chapter 12. Peace.